We started Keisha Warrior Princess because of a very personal story about our daughter who was diagnosed with uh, stage four breast cancer at 30 years old. And she fought valiantly for four years, but eventually it took her life. Since the beginning of her diagnosis, she became the strongest person ever. I was in awe of everything that she went through and how strong she was. She was definitely a warrior, and that's the reason why we came up with Keisha Warrior Princess for the name of the foundation. She was so kind and loving, and when she was diagnosed at age 30 with stage four breast cancer and she called me, she was more worried about me and how I felt. We talked about the reality of helping other women not go through the same experience. And she gave us permission to tell her story, which hopefully draws people in to allow them to, to hear the, the mission, which is to save women 25 to 45. We want them to act and to take action by doing monthly breast exams and to also uh, visit their gynecologist on an annual basis. My own daughter, uh, because of seeing what Keisha went through, she was doing self-exams and she found a uh, very fast-growing tumor uh, as a result of that, that I don't believe otherwise she would have found for a very long time. Cancer.gov says that 12% of all women will be diagnosed with breast cancer in their lifetime. 11% of those that are diagnosed are under 45. Stage one and two has a 97% survival rate of five years or more, 97%. But if I move to stage three and it becomes regional, then it changes to 83% survival. But stage four, which our amazing daughter was when she found hers, and it's only 22%. The earlier you find it, the better chance you have for survival. Talk to your healthcare provider and find out if you perhaps could be at high risk for breast cancer to ensure that if something is in your family history that it is detected very early. The first thing you can do to be a part of our mission is to ask her. Ask the women in your life, have, are, they, are they doing these things? Are they taking action? Make sure you ask your friends, ask your mom, ask your aunt, ask, ask everyone. The second thing you can do is to visit our website, our socials, which will direct you to more resources. There is a video on our website about how to do a, a self-exam. We distribute a shower card that explains how to do a self-breast exam. We would love for anyone to go onto the website and sign up to actually receive one of the self-exam cards. This is co-branded with West Cancer Foundation, but more than anything, we thought this is such a great idea. We've all seen the shower cards. They've been around for years, but this one is very unique. We have a goal of distributing 500,000 of those cards in by 2025. Keisha was a special daughter. She was an advocate for herself. What she said to me about this nonprofit was to be an advocate for others. She wanted her story to, to do that.